What is good everybody, welcome back to the channel. For today's video, we're gonna be taking a look at the latest from Jerry Lorenzo, and that is the Fear of God Athletics campaign. Just a quick little rundown, Jerry Lorenzo, who has been dominating the streetwear scene for the better part of the last five years. Good friends with Kanye, Virgil, and of course, creative director and founder of the brand Fear of God, left his position over at Nike to go ahead and work with Adidas, ultimately culminating in about three years work which we get to see manifest itself here today in this campaign also thanks to jerry leaks we have the leaked images of what to come in drop one along with prices as well as a brief description so shout out to jerry leaks for that but just before we jump into it i did want to let you know that my new company aura watches just went live for a soft launch exclusively for the Locust Wild Honey community. This company, Aura Watches, has been a project between myself and an entire team of people for the better part of four years. We specifically engineered these watches to have all the same great technical and luxury attributes that these $10,000, sometimes $100,000 watches have at an actual achievable price point. We're talking automatic movements with bi-directional self-winding, that means no batteries, 80-hour power reserve, that means it won't die if you're not wearing it, that durable scratch resistant sapphire glass face. The list just goes on and on, especially when it comes to value. And exclusive to the Locust and Wild Honey community is early access and a 30% discount just as a way of me saying thank you to you guys for making my dreams come true, rocking with me through all these years here on YouTube. As you guys know, I don't take really any sponsors here on the channel. Very, very selective. And I assure you, I've denied quite a bit of work simply due to the fact that I just don't want to compromise what we have going here on the channel but yeah that's another conversation for another day only things that I personally rock with here on the channel so let's go ahead and get this fear of God athletics campaign going and talk about it let's react to it and to see what Jerry's bringing to us I gotta pause right there, guys. I'm so sorry. Oh my goodness. Okay, so if you're not familiar uh, with the band Maverick City Music, uh, they have a song called Wait On You. That voice is Dante Bo, who is formerly a member of that group. And the song is absolutely amazing. I had a feeling that there might be um, a little bit of faith intertwined into the, this campaign, simply due to the fact that we have the Trinity, we have the three stripes, and Jerry has unapologetically uh, put his faith in Jesus on full display. So this is something I love to see. Uh, the song, its title is called Wait on You. The way that I was able to identify the song was because uh, Dante Bo, his voice said, there's something greater than me. And there's just so much power in opening the video uh, with that line, just functioning from a sense of humility. And the song Wait On You is essentially about waiting on God's timing, waiting on his perfect and good will. Ultimately, uh, God does work everything for the good of those who love him and are called according to his purpose. And um, yeah, that's what the song's about. I love the song choice. That is amazing. Let's go ahead and uh, keep watching. This is good. Oh man, all right, I gotta pause real quick. This is so good. We got threes. We got threes all throughout uh, this already. We're only 10 seconds in to this campaign. I gotta stop again because uh, there's so much imagery here, so much significance, so much foreshadowing, if you will. So we got um, the three pillars at the beginning. We had the three walking on water, Peter being called by Jesus to walk upon the water. As long as Peter's eyes are fixated on Jesus, he's able to walk on water. We got the three individuals in the fear of God, athletics attire, three of them walking on on water segueing into the three pillars yet again standing tall and strong 
And as I kind of mentioned, three very, very significant, according to biblical numerology, three, we got the Trinity, Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Three is known as a number of completion. Three is known as perfection. In the beginning, there were three. You had God, Adam, and Eve. In the end, when the law was fulfilled, you had the three. You had the two sinners and Jesus there in the middle, which signified the atonement for all humanity's sin. The number three just means so much, and it's it's just giving me goosebumps. Uh, just just seeing what Jerry's been able to do. I, I, he's just such a creative, and I, I just love this so much. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna keep watching here. Got the three again. The music's so epic. Wow. Wow, okay, I think that's it. Okay, it's, it's over. Okay. It, it might kind of seem like I'm a little bit too excited for this. I didn't even really focus on the clothes, which we will talk about. We will for sure talk about and break things down, get my opinions and pricing and all that good stuff. But that that was so good. Like, you guys just don't know. I am going to have to rewatch this on my own again because um, I do believe there's just so much meaning in, like, all of this intertwined. And just right off the jump, I... I just kept having to stop and it was like a 30 second video. I think that's enough with that. Let's go ahead and take a look at the clothing. Let's talk about what's dropping uh, for first release. I did want to preface this and give you forewarning. The pricing is slightly elevated. This is not your average Adidas. It is not your essentials. This is going to be fitting perfectly in between Fear of God essentials and Fear of God mainline. So expect a higher tier of price point. Let's go ahead and talk about it. First item is the suede fleece track jacket, priced at $380. This piece is going to be comprised of a heavy double knit to provide structure and comfort. As entailed in the name, it is finished in a really premium rich looking suede. Anyways, it is going to fit oversized. It is comprised of polyester and a last stain, so it's going to have a bit of stretchability. $380, this is a very cool looking piece. It is a women's piece. It's intriguing to me in the sense that it's probably going to be cropped and I might need to pick this one up. I'm gonna be going to the Atmosphere event because I'm gonna be able to get good sizing and try this stuff on. Uh, stay tuned for that video. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you wanna see that vlog. Um, moving on, we have here a pair of the Hike pants priced at $380. These are gonna be comprised of a heavy polar fleece. Polar fleece is already really warm. It doesn't need to be heavy. This is going to probably be just top tier. If you guys live in the colder climates, I think this might be something to consider. Next up, we have the Athletics Goalie Jersey. If you guys caught the Hollywood Bowl show, Pusha T was wearing this piece. Certainly pretty unique in terms of design and the way that it's cut. Priced at $460 though. It's a bit steep for that reason. I'm gonna be skipping on it. Uh, just because $460, I want something that I'm gonna wear consecutively or like pretty frequently. This is something that you can really only wear once because it sticks out like a sore thumb. It's so unique. And um, yeah, it's not something I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of. So practicality standpoint, I'm probably gonna skip on, but it's a very cool piece uh, overall. Next up, we have the Athletics Puffer Jacket comprised of Prima Loft 100G fill and water resistant shell. Um, it does feature a mock neck, it looks like. It's a very clean looking puffer. You got the nice rip stops on the side as well, so you can kind of adjust it to fit how you like. This piece is going to be priced at $550, putting it right in competition with some of those other uh, warm, down-filled uh, puffer jackets that are available that are water-resistant, all-weather type. Next up is a pair of sweatpants I'm personally really excited about and do plan on picking up. These are the suede fleece sweatpants. So again, with that suede exterior, it's gonna have that dry kind of suede effect. This pair here is 340 bucks bit pricey for some sweatpants but again you're gonna have that super premium finish uh, they're very distinct in nature and uh, yeah this is definitely going to be a pair of sweats that i'm gonna be picking up uh, for myself very very fire i love the contrasting stripe as well and it does come in the reverse colorway from what we're seeing in the event you want to get a full matching set they also have the suede fleece hoodie 
It's got the scuba neck. It's priced at $400. And the reason why I'm skipping is because I'm going to be getting the contrasting logo scuba hoodie. And um, I just like this one a little bit more. And again, it is going to fit oversized. So take that into account. 465 GSM. Uh, it is pretty heavy. With that to say, 280 kind of pricey it's not going to be that suede material something to take into account but um what's cool about this is it does have uh, the branding on there maybe the t-shirt version can compete which i'll pull up right now three fourth mock neck 230 if if branding is a big part of of purchasing this stuff i'd probably go with the hoodie get a little bit more bang for your buck again gonna fit oversized for me i'm not gonna get this just because you know the oversized thing um is not necessarily for me as much anymore um at least for tops uh, a lot of people were complaining saying that this is very yay-esque on the other hand uh, people were complaining oversized aesthetic is kind of withdrawn back in like 2017 that's when it was cool like jerry's late type thing and to me it's just like which one is it you know what i mean is jerry like wrong for being jerry or is jerry wrong for keeping that yay aesthetic alive and well and you know, does that make sense if jerry wants to keep things oversized um that's him but at the same and people are giving a hard time for that but at the same time people are saying it looks like stuff that Ye has made when you know in retrospect Ye and jerry are very tight they're good friends Ye pulled up to uh the rose bowl show and they've worked very very close and as a matter of fact jerry designed for Ye uh for multiple years and by Ye's request so just something to take into consideration that you can't please everybody so at the end of the day do you and do what god's put on your heart and so that's what i'd say about that to keep it moving here looks like we have a trench on the way 700 dollars. wow so uh, the fear of god athletics car coat is crafted with a brushed woven back strong silhouette with a soft brush interior yeah i probably like this is not too conducive to like my height you know i'm on the shorter side so i'll probably pass on this one poncho 370 bucks uh it's comprised of that suede material very very fire this is intriguing to me like i might just cop this to just rock like in the crib you know just like while watching tv or something with gabby just i know it looks really comfortable to me and as i kind of already mentioned that a uh, suede material is very comfortable and it, it looks just super duper premium so very fire on that front and um that essentially concludes it for uh the pieces that stuck out to me oh actually i take that back we do have these sweatpants the heavy fleece sweatpants and this is supposed to be the pairing with the hoodie that i do plan on picking up so i might pick this one up as well 465 gsm very very heavy uh, you got the contrasting adidas logo there you got the three stripes which is it looks to be tonal it's not self fabric so it's just a tonal uh hit on the side there and uh yeah very fire kind of reminiscent of uh essentials a little bit and um it's just going to be way higher quality comparatively speaking um which is come to be expected at that 245 price point yeah um kind of i'm kind of on the fence with this i have to see how this one fits in person once i go to the atmosphere pop-up uh that's kind of my thoughts on everything on the collection the pricing i'd be interested in hearing what the community has to say down below and i hope you guys did enjoy today's upload what do you plan on picking up from this collection i'm curious and more to come on the footwear in the coming days. I'll catch you guys in the next upload. Thanks so much for the opportunity to get to serve you through making content. Go ahead and check out Aura Watches, my new company. This is something I've been working on for a minute. And I'm so excited to present to you. As always, guys, thank you so much. I'll catch you in the next upload. Peace and be blessed.